Hi everyone, Chris here. Welcome to the Thomas YouTube channel. We have Thomas Blug in the house. <laughs> You brought the Mercury Edition, right? The brand new Amp One, yeah. Which is really interesting. You guys heard it already. Um, it, we did a little A/B test against the JTM, right? And I will not tell you for like a minute or so uh, which was which. The switch was on. That's an amp. The switch off. That's it's the other amp. one. Get so uh, let us know in the comments before I tell anything. Your goal was to have a really versatile amp that's sort of vintage voice, but not only vintage focused. Right. Yeah and does a pretty good impression of like classic huge heavy stupid ass amps which are not nice to carry around but yeah but they sound so good this plexi here is out of my collection so this is like a reference point to me and um you know all the sounds i'm doing is um they should be as good as the real deal and this is like a little thing that proves that l my little M1 box, you know, which is able to achieve that kind of quality level with my technology. Crazy. Yeah. But what, what drives me really crazy, how it has the sponginess of a real tube amp. And I'm really curious what's, what's, what brand of uh, fairy dust you've <laughs> been using, or I don't know. It, it's all in the ears, you know, I mean, my experience over the last 30 years is like I pay attention to all details and the recipe of the amp one is exactly the same recipe like in a tube amp, just using different components. Okay. Up to the last point where the amp, the power amp reaches the speaker and the communication there is the important thing. Okay, to have this uh, two-way street instead of the one-way street, you know, because... It is having the feedback just like on a tube amp. Okay. It's it's the two-way street. Exactly. I'm aware of all these all tube phenomena, yeah. and I have created a way of using the same phenomena without any exception, just with different technology. Way more compact and yeah. way more modern yeah. to, to solve that same yeah. uh, thing. All right, so the amps. Mm -hmm. Drum roll. <laughs> the lamp on was the LED on was the Marshall, right? Yeah. yeah. We and can prove that. On. And off is and now yeah all right um, can we play this a little with with a, a humbucker guitar the Gibson yeah sure the, no sa more. the same AB <laughs> There's a tiny bit of a yeah, difference, sure. yeah. but I, I couldn't possibly tell which is which. Listen to this. That's the Marshall, and before it was my amp. It's not on the level like we are in a different world, you know? No, 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 not you at know? all. Okay, but uh, talking about features, you know, of course there's a lot more. You know, now I have like my reverb. <laughs> then I have a boost. You know, and it does all the cleaning up things. Yeah, yeah. So this is just the vintage channel, the new Mercury Edition vintage channel. I have four channels in total. You know, there's a clean channel and there's a, a classic channel and a modern channel. And these channels also have uh, the custom controls on the side. Yeah. So there's like a tone stack on this side of the custom control and another tone stack on the other side. And I can actually blend between the two. Uh, talking of which, different sounds and, and channels. Yeah. Round two, A being the uh, mid 60s original Super Reverb. Okay. You tell me what's what. I mean, <laughs> well, you know already. I know how it's wired, but yeah. if I if I close my eyes, it's like yeah, I'm not sure anymore. 
It's, it's pretty uh, close. It's pretty there's close. a tiny dif- bit of difference, but the the voicing is pretty spot s- on. Mm-hmm. The amount of bass and treble is exactly the same. Yeah. It's just something probably in the mid range, which is you know, but it's it's not like Who I can? like one more than the other. Yeah. It's like two very similar sounds. Yeah. Ready? Enough comment. <laughs> 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 then uh, LED on was the amp. What yeah. would you say is the biggest deal in the Mercury Edition? I paid more attention, even more attention, on the modern sounds. The overdrive channels in general became a bit tighter. You get the same tone quality, which fits on your pedal board, yeah. has universal power. Anywhere on this planet where there's a power outlet, it will sound exactly the same. Okay. Not like these bodies here, yeah. because they sound different in the US than in Germany. <laughs> yeah, yeah. but stage. for fly gigs and everything, <laughs> that's, that's the, the way to go. And this still has 100 watts, which yeah, means it's really it's, loud, yeah. it is loud. Forget about volume issues. issues yeah. Can you walk me through the, the channels? Sure. Um, just, I'll just grab a guitar, whatever. So, um, I didn't change anything from the Les Paul now. Yeah. volume gives you a, a even richer tone it will start to break up yeah Crazy with this, this truck, 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 truck. Yeah. It has the, the richness of a, a huge head, not even like a lunchbox. Yeah. And imagine now combine this with any of your favorite pedals. Yeah. It, yeah. It, this is designed to take pedals. Yeah, I do own the original one and I yeah. use it as a pedal board setup. I cool. get it. Yeah. Uh, okay, next let's, channel. Let's, let's channel. We go for the vintage mm-hmm. and without the boost. So this now is vintage with a low gain setting, mm. around four. Crazy, so, wow. And maybe um, while you're playing, I will increase the gain and balance out the volume. Oh yeah, absolutely. So you can see how this channel will absolutely. change. Yeah. And I even gave it a boost as That's well. It's like a hot rod, Marshall. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Wow. We go. Sounds we right. go for the for the classic channel with no boost. I start also with low again. This is like high gain with all the options. Yeah, it's um, way too much gain actually, yeah. but it still is articulate and you hear yeah. the pick. We can also change the tone. It is not that much, but it is like more from the traditional tone control to a more 800 tone stack. Okay, okay. So uh, that's okay. on the side, right? The yeah. tiny knob. Yeah. Okay. okay. <laughs> I mean, that's a telly, yeah. and that's like an old school British voice <laughs> thing, yeah. and it, it just, it's really tight, yeah. is, what, is what I want to say. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, then the modern. modern, let me see, we start on the lower tone settings here. Okay. <laughs> And 
other way? Yeah, okay, the other way is a bit sharper, like here. Okay, uh, that's it. with a single yeah. coil, yeah, yeah. probably too yeah, sharp. Okay. That's some volume there. Oh my god. Yeah. And it's way, way more tight yes, than the yeah, original yeah, version. Yeah, yeah. Every channel is like very well centered somewhere and still has some range to go yeah. to extremes. Yeah. I grab maybe this guitar here. As long as I get your strap. <laughs> Such a good guitar, by the way. <laughs> 61, right? Yeah, 61. Just to show you, I give go to the classic and use the tone stack closed and the treble up. I need my wig. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and this is like the, the treble of the amp on 10. And it still sounds it's not musical. Really pokey at all. Yeah, yeah. One last sentence about the nanotube. Yeah. What does that really do? The power itself is done with uh, class D, but it's not neutral as a standard class D. Yeah, the is, tube works yeah. in collaboration with this. And the tube, to me, gives a natural overtone, compression, and so the whole thing feels like a tube amp. Okay. The tube is the last bit, you know, yeah. even though I know yeah. all the rest too. <laughs> <laughs> Great. All yeah. right. Thomas, thank you very much. It's always a pleasure to hey. meet you. Big and pleasure um, being uh, here. Take care. I'll take this one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, you guys take it easy. If there are some comments and criticism, let me know because I will oh, yeah. check that out for my next product. You know? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. It's inspiration yeah. all the time. All right. Know? Cheers, guys. Cheers. Take it easy.